Hi everyone, welcome to Mother Ulaham. Today I'm going to make lamb biryani, pineapple curry, and cucumber raita. I have pre prepared all the ingredients for this meal. Here I have 2 cup of basmati rice soak in water for half an hour. If we soak in water, it will only take less amount of time to cook the rice. Here I have half a kilo of lamb cut into big chunk pieces. Spices and here I have half a kilo of um, pineapple cut into big chunk for the curry and cucumber for the raita. Now I'm going to cut the onion into small pieces. It's better to um, have the red onion but if you have the white onion that's okay too. And cut the tomato into small pieces as well. Here I have one and a half inch of ginger, 10 cloves of garlic. I'm going to mash them like this. Now everything's been done, I'm going to start cooking. Here I have two tablespoons of oil. I'm going to place it in a hot pan. Add the spices. Here two bay leaf, two sticks of cinnamon one star anise three or four cardamom three or four cloves half a teaspoon of cumin seeds i'm going to leave it in the oil for one or two minutes for for the spices to release its aroma after one or two minutes i'm going to add the onion here i have two medium sized onion cut into small pieces like this saute it i'm going to add some salt here i'm adding half a teaspoon of salt so that the onion will cook nice and quickly once the onion started to turn color add the ginger and garlic paste that we made it earlier Leave it for one or two minutes and then add the chopped tomato. Here I'm adding two medium sized tomato. Add chili. I'm adding three green chili here. Two teaspoons of Kashmiri chili powder. You can add any chili powder for your spiciness you want. Half a teaspoon of turmeric powder. This cashmere um, red chili powder is not that spicy. Here I'm adding half a teaspoon of garam masala. I will give the link for the garam masala in the description box if you want to check it. Here I have half a kilo of lamb cut into pieces like this. I'm going to mix it and then Close the lid and cook it for 10 minutes. While I'm waiting for this, I'm going to cut this coriander leaves and mint leaf. Here I have half a cup of mint leaf and coriander leaf. I'm going to add this into the meat. Also, I'm going to add half a cup of yogurt this will give nice and moist to the biryani once we mixed it i'm going to close the lid and cook it for 15 minutes now the lamb release its own water and cook very well i'm going to add half a cup of coconut milk here now that we're going to add the rice i'm going to add two cup of water total of four cup of liquid should be in the uh, pan 
for the rice to cook. Now I'm adding two teaspoons of salt or salt for your taste. Now the liquid in the pan is starting to boil. I'm going to add the rice that we soak in water for half an hour. We need to rinse the rice before we place it in the pan. Give it a good mix and then I'm going to add one whole lime juice. Mix it one more time and then place the lid and cook it for 20 to 25 minutes until all the water evaporate from the rice. After 25 minutes, this is how it looks like. The rice incorporate and cooked very well and it came out so nice. I'm just going to drizzle some ghee on top of that. I'm adding one tablespoon here but it, it's totally up to you. Now I'm going to turn off the stove and place the lid and leave it for 15 minutes before we serve. Now in another pan, I'm going to add one tablespoon of oil half a teaspoon of mustard seed, half a teaspoon of fennel seeds, some curry leaf, two dry chili, two or three dry chili, half medium size onion. I'm going to place this in the pan and leave it to cook for one or two minutes. Add half an inch of cinnamon stick. I'm going to put it just like that. So that the once the curry been cooked, we can take it out. Adding two cloves, two cardamom pot. Give it a mix and then add half a kilo of pineapple chunk. Cut into big pieces like this. Mix it and add half a teaspoon of turmeric powder. 1 teaspoon of curry powder, 1 teaspoon of salt or salt for your taste. Mix it and close the lid and cook it for 5 to 10 minutes. After 7 or 8 minutes, open the lid and give a good mix. And then add half a cup of coconut milk. Mix it and then close the lid and cook it for another 10 minutes. Liquid dry off. Now, after 10 minutes, this is how it looks like. All the liquid dried off. This pineapple curry go really well with the biryani. Now the curry is been ready. I'm going to make the raita. I'm taking half. Lebanese um, cucumber, quarter onion, and some coriander leaves. Now I'm going to grate the cucumber, chop the coriander into small pieces, chop the onion. Add one cup of yogurt into a bowl. Mix it well. And then add cucumber, onion and coriander leaves. Add one teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of cumin powder. Mix it well. And now the raita is also ready. I made this lunch for Diwali. And it came out so good. Just for the decoration, I'm just putting the mint leaf on top of the lamb biryani. I hope everyone who celebrated the Diwali had a good time. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please like, share and comments. If you like to see more of my video, 
please subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching.